Hello, hello guys. So in yesterday's video, I mentioned about how we always have so much cardboard and I want to try to start recycling it. And somebody said that I should do it for Earth Day because it's literally in a few days from now. And I'm like, that is such a great idea. I already have a craft picked out for the kids to do. And I was trying to think of something that they could do to celebrate Earth Day. And the first thing that came to mind was like, picking up trash and I'm like they can't do that they're too little it's just not safe for them to do that and then I was like well maybe planting a tree or something and then I was like but where would we do that like I don't know I just couldn't think of anything and as soon as I read the comment about recycling our boxes for Earth Day I'm like yes that is what we are going to do today is trash day so John is gathering up all the trash and I am gathering up recycling Surprisingly, it was kind of hard to find a recycling center that takes cardboard. Most of them, at least in our area, only take like um, steel, copper, things like that. Some of them take like batteries, automotive parts, but to find somebody that takes like glass, paper, cardboard, it was kind of hard. This is our cardboard stash. There's lots of cardboard boxes in here but I need to take out stuff like this because that's not recyclable. Recyclable? Recyclable. 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 Re what is it for real? Recyclable. Recyclable? Yeah. Yeah, that sounds right. Recyclable. It's not recyclable. Now it doesn't sound right. Recyclable. You can't recycle it. <laughs> there it we go. It is non-recyclable. It is non-recyclable. <laughs> <laughs> Can you recycle pizza boxes? It says so. I thought because of the grease you couldn't. It didn't say you couldn't. Okay. I mean, what's the worst thing that can happen? They Let say no. Check. Yeah. I really thought because of the grease. Maybe like, uh, I was going to say the top of the box, but there's grease on it too. What about stuff like this that has like the painting stuff on it? So that's a no because it's covered in plastic. This is plastic? Wait, it shows the recycle thing on it, doesn't it? Where? Yeah. What's Flatten it before recycling. Clean and dry. Yeah, okay. So these are good. Yeah, but the pizza box is a no-go. No for the pizza. That's what I thought because of the grease on it. That's a little unfortunate. Okay, so this is a yes. Take the tape off, right? I guess. Yeah. That's a definite yes, right? Right. It's hot out here. I'm sweating just sitting here doing this. Oh, tape. What all do they take other than cardboard? Metal and plastics. Do they take glass, like spaghetti bottles and stuff? If you rinse them out? They're supposed to. This one doesn't have a recycle symbol, is that okay? I feel like we're already going, so we might as well just bring what we have, and the worst that can happen is they say no. You know what I mean? So, because I know some of these boxes for sure are okay. So. It should be fine. We probably just tore off the recycled part. Okay. When I was little, my grandma and grandpa used to take us to collect cans on the side of the road, mostly just to like clean up the road, you know. And we would smash the cans and take them in to recycling. And that's pretty much the only time I ever think that I've recycled anything before. It's not that I don't want to, like I want to, it's just like, it's not a widespread thing at least in our area like they don't even come to your house and get it because I know in Florida a lot of people had like their trash can and their recycling can and the recycling truck would come pick it up they don't do that here where we live so it's something that I want to do I've just never really done it before maybe I'm wrong and they do come to your house and we just aren't signed up for it I don't know but I guess we will find out when we go on Earth Day to the recycling center. How much do they charge? They don't. They actually pay you. 
I don't know if they pay you for cardboard boxes, but they pay you for like metal and stuff. But it doesn't cost anything. It might cost something for them to come pick it up at your house, but for you to take it in, it doesn't cost anything. Look it up. I wonder if I'm taking all the stickers and tape off for no reason and they don't care. But I'm doing it anyways. I feel like that's what I should do, so that's what I'm doing. Uh, what about this, John? As long as it's corrugated cardboard. It's not. It's like particle board almost. Oh. This yeah. looks like wood. Yeah. What do you think? I think we should keep this. <laughs> oh my gosh. There's two of them in here. Here. It was just the packaging for the bed frame. Okay. Sounds like I'll recycle it. All right. That is a pretty decent chunk of cardboard. I'm not sure if you're supposed to, but I did remove all of the tape, all of the labels, everything like that. So it's just cardboard. There is like a little bit of sticky residue on some of the boxes but most of them are like super good super clean good to go Theo said that we needed to throw it in the trash and I was like nobody we're not going to throw this in the trash we're going to recycle it we're going to take it somewhere and they're going to make it into something new and reuse it instead of it going into the trash and he was like oh okay <laughs> hi Leon hey buddy Oh my gosh, his poor little eyes look awful. Hi, dude. Let's go get his fish. Yeah, gotta play with that fishy. I think today is definitely in like the top three worst allergy days for Leon by far. He has just been scratching his eyes all day. His nose has actually been like giving him some trouble as well. He has scratched so much that he actually has like a little bit of a, um, it's not a cut, but it's like he just rubbed it raw on his eye. And I'm just like, oh my goodness. And they're super puffy. And this morning when he woke up, he could barely even open them. And I'm like, buddy, don't scratch, don't scratch, okay? I just gave him some eye drops and some allergy medicine. I like to give it in the evening time because I've heard that it can make you drowsy. So hopefully that helps him a little bit. I don't know. I did like a little compress on his eyes to just like try to relieve some stuff, but I don't know if it worked. It's just, it's hard. It's one of those things where I want to help him so much, but there's nothing I can do. He's been to the doctor. He has medicine. It's just, He's just struggling with it, huh, little guy? I don't even know if you guys can tell how bad his eyes are today. Oh, he wants his fish. <laughs> Hopefully, he has a better day tomorrow because today was just kind of miserable for Leon. You see outside? <laughs> he wants to go outside so bad, but I just don't think it's a good idea right now. I'm just hoping the allergist calls us like really, really soon and he can get an appointment like that day or the next, you know, and just get everything sorted out. I'm hoping that that works. Like that's like what I'm banking on is that the allergist can like help him and that'll work and that'll be like the fix all. I'm not even going to think about the fact that maybe it won't work. We're just not going to think about that. We're going to put that out of our mind and just say that that's going to work for us. So we're just waiting for that call to make him an appointment for that. Are you guys almost ready for bed? No. We had one yes and one no. <laughs> oh. <laughs> I love you. I'm down. Mommy down. Down. Okay. Mommy down. Okay, I'll wait for mommy to <laughs> Yeah. Say love you, daddy. Nope, you got down yourself. You gonna put them to bed? Yes. Thank you. I did jammies and everything. I know, they're so. all ready. All I gotta do is make sure all the night lights are on, all the sound machines are on, <laughs> and Leon's got his video going. Yep. yep. Okay. <laughs> oh 
my gosh, you're so dramatic. <laughs> you forgot to go, oh, as you were getting up. Oh. <laughs> if you made it to this point of our video, then you know it's time for our birthday shout outs. Happy birthday to Gabby. Thank you all so much for watching. Please like, share, subscribe, and if you'd like, become a member. And we'll see you in our next video. Bye, guys. Thank you.